Meditation from the Health and Healing Series at supportnet.ca. Resources for your recovery. Recovery is learning to enjoy life without the use of alcohol or drugs that alter mind or mood. It is treatment for the condition of addiction, an approach to the challenges of life, and a path to personal growth. Recovery requires us to learn about the true nature of addiction. It may be personalized, but it has its necessary principles and its ways. The principles of recovery provide direction to the choices that we face each day. The ways of recovery provide us with tools that help us to heal and to enjoy life on life's terms. This learning seminar introduces you to active meditation, what you need to know, how it works, and how it can help you to enjoy your life today. What is meditation? Meditation is a word of many meanings. Mostly, it is about being alert, aware, and accepting of our experience in just being here, right now. Meditation is letting go of the busyness of the world, the clutter in our mind, and of the feelings that pass within us. It is learning to calm, center, and to ground ourselves. Meditation is learning to watch, listen, and feel without being tossed about by the things that happen around and within us. It is learning to see and to accept things as they really are. Active Meditation Active meditation helps those who are easily distracted or who struggle with an overly restless mind to get started in meditation. Active meditation may be the best place to start if you are in early recovery from addiction, if you struggle with attention deficit or traumatic memories. Active meditation uses your body and its movement to help you to learn how to settle your mind. Examples of active meditation include walking meditation, progressive muscular stretching, and abdominal breathing. In walking meditation, you take a walk and just rest your mind on the sensations in your feet, legs, and hips. You feel your hips shift with each step. The muscles in your legs tighten and relax, and your feet taking one step at a time. As in any meditation, you will find your mind pulled away. Just let go of whatever distracts you and rest your mind back on your walking steps. Walking meditation gives you a break in the day, anytime and anywhere. Bend your feet upwards at the ankle until you feel the muscles in the back of your leg stretch. Then relax your feet and feel the relaxation come into your legs. Now stretch your feet downwards until you feel the front of your legs stretch. Relax and feel your legs settle. Do the same with your hands. First, bend your wrist up and back. Feel your muscles pull. Then let your arms relax. Now bend your hand down under your arm. Relax again and rest. Stretch and relax. Let your mind rest on this movement as you go from one muscle group to another throughout your body. This is progressive muscular relaxation. Feel a breath come in through your nose. Let it flow deeply into your belly. Notice your belly rise out a little with your in-breath. Let your breath go and just relax. Abdominal breathing is our natural way to breathe. Do it over and again at any time during your day. Breathing to the top of your chest can lead to nervous feelings. Neither your chest nor your shoulders need move during natural abdominal breathing. Breathe deeply into your belly. Let go and feel the relaxation come into your body. Getting started. Before you begin to meditate, there are a few things to consider in getting yourself ready. It may not be a great idea to have a cup of coffee or a chocolate bar shortly before spending time in meditation. These foods tend to agitate the mind and body. They will frustrate your practice. When you are ready to spend a few minutes in meditation, find some time to yourself or with a partner. 
make sure that you have gone to the washroom first. Maybe turn the ring down on your telephone. Wear loose and comfortable clothing. Choose one way to start your practice. Walking meditation, progressive muscular relaxation, or abdominal breathing. Just rest your mind on what you are doing. Walking, stretching, or breathing. Don't force or pressure yourself. You will soon find yourself lost in a daydream or planning what to have for dinner tonight. Just return your mind to what you are doing, walking, stretching, or breathing, and let your mind rest there again. Each time that you return your mind to what you are doing, you are learning the practice of active meditation. One step at a time, you learn about the wandering tendencies of your mind, about how to work with its restlessness, how to stay calm and centered in your actions right now. Whatever happens during active meditation, don't pressure yourself. Few of us find it easy to settle our mind. Don't try to force your mind to your will. When you notice yourself off in a daydream, just let the imagining go and rest your mind back on your activity. There is nothing in meditation that is supposed to happen, and there is no test of how good you are at it. Active meditation starts where you are at today. It introduces you to the calming and focusing exercises that are common to many types of meditation. In summary, active meditation uses body movement to help us to calm and focus our mind. It helps those who are easily distracted or who struggle with an overly restless mind to get started in meditation. Active meditation helps us to learn skills, useful skills in relaxation, attention, self-awareness, and observation. It allows us to see how easily our mind can carry us off with it and helps us to learn to stay grounded in this moment. You have now reached the end of Active Meditation. Look for this and other learning series topics at www.supportnet.ca. Resources for your recovery.